Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. Now, I have not had a haul this big since the early days of the SS Motion with Sam and Craig. I got this enormous box for a huge steal on Facebook Marketplace and you won't believe what's inside. I can barely even hold this thing up. This thing is enormous. So almost all of this will be on sale soon on my eBay, link in the description below. If you buy anything from my eBay, you are literally helping me get back to Hong Kong and fulfill my dreams making videos there. And oh my goodness, there is so much mega box in here. This is exciting. This is what I'm gonna wanna focus on first. This is just a box filled with figures. Whoa, let's break these figures down one by one. What do we have here? Woo! I would say maybe 40 or 50 figures. I'm so excited. And there's some really rare ones too. First of all, this isn't a figure. Locusty legs, locusty heads. Piece of a red brute chopper. Aha! I've been looking for more. Oh no! Well, we're off to a bad start, folks. My Halo Reach Marine has George's shoulders or somebody's shoulders. He's got different arms. Purple Hunter and a blue Hunter. Very nice. The purple hunter seems to have a blue spine. I don't know why. Do we have another hunter? Yes, we do. There's another blue hunter. The spines are flipped upwards. We have a knight. And this is the knight from the pelican gunship. He has the really cool sort of screaming face. Spartan George. Really nice OG figure and one of the first named figures we got. An Elite Ultra in gold, a metallic red ODST, blue ODST, and a green ODST. This one I always really liked because it had pale human hands. Next we got some Flood Forms, Purple Elite, Orange Elite, another named figure, Spartan Palmer, the original one, Red Spartan Gungnir, Orange Flood, very nice, Spartan Recon in green, CQB in blue, Orange EVA, Four Marines, Ah, I love the skirmisher. We've got 12 elites here. Ah, ooh, the white elite ultra. Such a gorgeous figure. I was so sad in my last haul that this one came discolored, so this one looks really good. We're moving on to Halo 4 now. We've got two of these classic sort of Master Chiefs in green from the Warthog Resistance. The yellow version, Zealot and Storm Elite. Gorgeous red recon. These three Spartans here which, to be honest, I barely even know the name of. Then basic Halo Wars Spartans, three green, three red, one orange, two white, four little baby grunts, well, three little baby grunts and one big grunt, and an elite that has a purple head. A little baby flood here, a standard blue and purple brutes, and an AC brute, very nice. Two jump pack brutes, that's a great score. A brute chieftain, hopefully his gravity hammer is somewhere. Oh no, a poor Spartan EVA. How is that even a custom? You just doused it in white paint, ruined it. And then we've got blue Hazop. Ah, there's the Halo Reach Marines backpack. Two blue Marines, one yellow, one red, and the Halo Technician, which is a really cool civilian to get your hands on. The last figure of all, this Covert Ops Spartan Cat, the Air Assault. And that is an absolute bundle of figures. I don't know how many, at least 50. That's really exciting. We've got a Fusion Call as well, and just a bundle of weapons over here. The only other surprise is that I found this Magnum, which I think belongs to one of the Spartan Kit models, like the PVC kits. So we'll see if one of them is in the box. Cool start to the video. We've got so many little bits in here. I think that just like everything that fell off his vehicles He just popped in this box and now for the main event We're gonna get stuck in to this big box and first of all we got to clear some space now then The main thing I'm hoping for is that these sets are complete and not turned to dust I don't know if you guys watched my halo beats to build and study to but that video wasn't exactly intentional I wanted to get those things out of the hall and build them really quickly, and it took 12 and a half hours over seven days. So hopefully this is not gonna be the same thing. Hopefully most of these vehicles will be near complete, but let's see how we do. We've got the Seraph. 
And this one I pulled out first because it looks nearly complete. Only seems to be missing the front of the vehicle. The stuff in here looks quite damaged, but when I saw the Facebook Marketplace listings originally, they were all complete on a shelf and they were clearly just put in this box to transport. So I've got faith that they'll all be there. This is a good start. The Seraph is a wonderful set. Let's get on to the next big one. And this is the main reason I bought this set. Ooh, buddy. We've got... Oh, it's falling apart! It's falling apart! We've got the Lights and Sounds Pelican! Very nice. Definitely turned to dust. But not too bad. I think it's easily salvageable. We've got another wing for the Pelican there too. Okay. Not an amazing start there. Let's hope... Oh, this doesn't look good. This is the green Wolverine. It looks like there's been some alterations, especially these desert pieces that I think are from the original Scorpion. Base plate. All right, we got the Warthog Resistance. I called this one earlier with the two green Spartans from Halo 4. It's a gorgeous vehicle, and in my eyes, maybe the best Warthog they've ever made. They've made so many, and there's actually a really cool video comparing all of the Warthogs made recently on the Halo Podcast Evolve YouTube channel. You should check that out. Blue ODST. Ah, oh, I love this ODST, and this was one of my very first Mega Bloks figures I got. Aha, this looks complete. Look at that. The Flame Warthog. A spade. Ah, uh, which... Yeah, now this one has a lot of alterations. There's some green bricks running inside it. That's wrong. It's always the case with collectors. When kids start off, they build all of their sets, throw away the instruction manuals, and then the set slowly turn to dust or they use them for customs and one by one they have to try and figure out how to fix the sets. It's never, never that successful. But this looks good. The Red Troop Transport Hog. Looks 100% complete to me. Very nice. We've got a really cool collection of Warthogs. And continuing down that Warthog train, we've got an Arctic Gauss Hog. Very nice. Wow, this is, this is the Warthog Hall. This is all of the original Warthogs. Here we've got the Green Gauss Hog. Purple Barricades. The Covenant Revenant. Really nice set. And always an easy one to build because there's not many vehicles of this colour, so you just search for the bricks really easily. Okay, not bad. I mean, as long as, like, most of them are complete, then we won't have many spare pieces to look through. Turret from the Warthog Resistance. Three amun- Ooh! Ah! It's an ammunition crate full of backpacks! Arctic Warthog? Warthog? <laughs> Come on! Arctic Drop Pod? Oni Siege Bike? <gasps> oh. It's one of my favorite sets, the Mac Cannon. The Halo Reach Mac Cannon. Oh, I just used this in my Flood Diorama. You should check that video out. Hey! The AC ODST with the SOCOM pistol. Ah! The Space Banshee. Uh, it's a pretty cool little vehicle. I'll call this the, the Covenant Sledgehammer. Pretty cool custom, honestly. Pilot that has been sharpied or painted over. Really cool Halo 4 Ordnance Pod. Ah! The Black Mongoose. It says four pounds on it. Oh, and the Covert Mongoose. That's cool. Three Mongoose or Mongeese. Mongai. This is the Spartan suiting up armory bay that the technician came with or a little piece of it. The Cyclops, all of these silver pieces, do you know what these are from? These are from the Falcon, which is, yeah, that's not looking very good. But then other than that, we've got the Falcon and we've got the Cobra, but the Cobra is really in a sorry state, but it was never a very good structural build anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. There we go! That is... That is the new Halo Megablocks Hall in its glory, in all its glory. This has kind of turned to dust, a lot of it but I'm quite confident that I can build most of this up. Hopefully I can recover the majority of these 100% complete, and then the ones that are missing pieces, I'll get them out of my own collection. BRB, or be right back.
And just like that, we are done. I am very certain that this time lapse that we just did will make it look a lot easier than it actually was because this was not easy. Um, the number one problem was the fact that the kid had rebuilt all the sets but incorporated different colors, like the wrong colors, all the way through. So I had to take apart and rebuild the majority of it. I hope you enjoyed a time lapse, first time I've ever done that. And yeah, I mean, check out the haul. This was well worth it now. Up until this point, I was very doubtful. I, I, I couldn't see the light at the end of the tunnel, but now we're here. This looks fantastic. Let me talk you through everything we got. Covenant Seraph, Wolverine, Armory Bay, EVA's Last Stand. We got a Mac Cannon, it's not complete, but I kind of like it. It just sort of positions on there, it looks pretty good. Flame Warthog, Oni Siege Bike, two Space Banshees, that was interesting, a real surprise. Original Locust versus Gauss Hog. Then we've got the Lights and Sounds Pelican. Lights and Sounds Pelican, and Lights and Sounds Cobra as well. Ooh. And then we've got a Red Troop Transport, a UNSC Spade, a Falcon with Landing Pad, Small AA Gun, Warthog Resistance, Revenant, we've got a Bubble Shield, a Cyclops, a UNSC Recruitment Center, ODST Ambush, we've got an Arctic Warthog, and then all of these beautiful figures. And one, two Mongooses as well, Mongoose Eye, Mongoose. Yeah, all of these figures, I can't wait to add some of these to my collection and also get them on sale on my eBay. This has been another epic Halo Mega Bloks haul with The Domain. Thank you very much for tuning in today. Keep on supporting me, keep on liking my stuff and anything you buy on my eBay will directly support my transition back to Hong Kong so I can make videos there and live my dream. And let's see, the Gold Hunter, always love this one, is signing off. Shh.